Kyle. And I'm Kyle. And welcome to Coffee with Kyle's. Cheers. Cheers. So where are we at today, Kyle? So um, I actually just forgot what it's called. Where are we at today? <laughs> Uh, we're at First Watch right here in Austin, Texas. Perfect. Uh, we road tripped from Dallas. And uh, thank you so very much, Daylight Savings Time, for robbing us of one hour of sleep last night. Right. We love you. Uh, we've been driving since 3 o'clock in the morning. Yeah. Or 4 o'clock. Yeah. Whatever. It's been crazy. But Something hey, like that. It's the life we lead and the journey we're on. The journey we're on. All right, guys, enjoy this montage from LinkedIn Local South by Southwest. We forgot to ask you a question. Um, if there was one person anybody in the world that you could have coffee with, who would it be? Oh, I know this is going to sound so fucking counterintuitive, but uh, you're going to say yourself, aren't you? No, 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 no. no. Oh, I was about to laugh if that was it. No, no, no. Believe it or not, I would have coffee with Hitler and like go, is this really, was it really worth it? That's a great question. That is a great answer. That's a great answer. Yeah, yeah they are. That's a one-way street. Oh. And she's driving one way, the wrong oh. way. Oh, yeah. Oh, you are? This entrance is locked. Please use main entrance. This is really, this is super dope. I'm glad I'm not. Yeah. I guess we're, uh, we're crashing this VC event. It worked out. Welcome to South By Coffee with Kyle's edition. And we're going to do a quick montage thing. So, uh, what's your name? Matt. Matt? Uh, thank you for being on Coffee with Kyle's. Real quick, in two words, what are you obsessed with? Go. Company building. What does that mean? It, it takes really talented people around an idea and you seed fund the idea and then you build that as a company and you help it grow. How do you like your coffee? Uh, straight black. Actually, I like it on Nitro. With you, what's your LinkedIn handle? Uh, M. Otterstetter. M. Otterstetter. Very hard to... Uh, Perfect. Yeah. Perfect. I'm here with uh, Brian and Brian. So, hey, gentlemen. Uh, funny meeting you guys. Uh, Kyle behind the camera and Kyle myself. The Kyles meet the Brians. Pretty awesome. So, cheers to you guys. Coffee there. Yeah. Um, how do you guys like your coffee? I take it black. Black? I, I only drink water. Only water. All water right. and alcohol. Water and alcohol. All right. Good man. Good man. Um, now, what are you guys most obsessed with in two words? Go. What about your friends? Oh, man. That's not the two words. <laughs> oh, <laughs> done. Uh, next. What I'm obsessed with happens in phases, and right now, what I'm obsessed with is oil. Is oil is oil. So that's one word. How's that? That um, works. I say that to give you a little bit more context. I went out to an oil field yesterday. I'm investing in a, in a, uh, a couple of wells uh, with some friends that we're drilling, and. I was reflecting, looking at all the co-investors, and we're all from the tech community, and none of us had actually been on an oil field before. So for all those people that are actually not from Texas, um, that think, uh, you know, we know a lot about that, we actually, we actually don't. We wore the wrong shoes, we were way out of our element, but it was so cool to see uh, what those processes were like. So temporarily, right now, until I get this deal done, I'm obsessed with oil. Autonomous vehicles. Autonomous vehicles, yes. And not because the vehicles themselves. All right. I like everything that's going to happen after that. Okay. So you think about, you know, when you no longer need to own a car, and everyone's, you know, ride sharing, there's no driver, that vehicle is able to just circulate constantly. Parking is no longer necessary, right? Yes. Every parking garage in every city is no longer valuable. At least it doesn't have the value it used to have, right? So are you going to repurpose it? Are you going to tear it down? What's going to happen there? It's really interesting. Roads as a whole. Like what, what's going to happen with roads when cars are 10x more efficient because you don't have human error in stopping, right? You yes. don't, you're not going to have the merging effect. And all of a sudden, that six-lane highway only needs to be two. Like, what do you do with so all that? long traffic. Yeah. yeah. Adios. Adios. Insurance. Like, what sure. happens when there are no longer accidents because there's human error is out of the question. Out of the question. Like, like, all of those, I think the time is cool, the cars are cool because I'm a tech guy, it's entertaining, right. but the impact outside of it's going to be just like the world change. Huge, huge, and then tying that into like blockchain, maybe. Like, yeah, oh, crazy. I mean, <laughs> everything crazy. on the blockchain. You everything. can overlay everything blockchain, blockchain on everything. Everything. All right, guys, how can we? How can uh, they connect with you? Be able to connect with you guys. Uh, so you can reach me at brian at trustventures.com uh, or Brian Talkman on LinkedIn. All right. Yeah, you can find me pretty easily. All right. Yeah. Uh, LinkedIn, Brian D. Chambers. Just reach out. <laughs> Kidding. No, I just don't want people to know. It's just addicted to Moon milk. Moon milk all day. Every day. My strange addiction. Oh, yeah. And that's it. 
Kyle, what's up, brother? How are you, man? Good to see you. Kyle, Kyle. I'm Chuck. Kyle. Now, I know you guys from the coffee with Kyle. Oh, yeah. Hey, what's going on, man? How are you? Because you said, guys, like, yeah. we're here, and I was like, uh, I'm up here. What's up? <laughs> the camera's not there. So what are you doing right now? I'm trying to work on a project that has to do with the communication of VR and AR in the education system. For example, imagine if you can learn, and specifically learning languages, imagine if people can actually like Imagine a cultural like, environment in the VR and they get to ask questions. For example, like, they go to the market and ask a question again. Okay, in that language, how much does it cost? In Spanish, for example. It's much better than just learning through textbooks and stuff like that. So that's what I'm currently working on with my team. And we've been doing a lot of research talking to professors and UT students to get some feedback. So, so far, it's okay. We don't know how, how big it's going to go. Alright, on the spot, Miranda. Oh my gosh. Uh, on the spot, Miranda, what are you most obsessed with? Two words. Most obsessed with helping others and fashion. So if I can at least help somebody or at least point them into the right direction to actually, you know, have them help somebody, then yep. I feel like it's easy. I'm Chad Gordon. Hi. How do you like your coffee? Ah, uh, lots of sugar, no cream. Okay. And uh, in two words, what are you obsessed with? Finding a job. All right, that's three words, but. <laughs> Finding a job. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, that, that's a short-term goal. It's a short-term goal. Uh, learning and helping. Guys, Kyle with me. Hey guys, Kyle with me here and we got Jess. <laughs> hey guys, Kyle with me here with Jesse Mathis. <laughs> I think you're discussing with him at this point. Okay, Jesse Mathis here, uh, a really nice vodka, sophomore music company. And so, first question, how do you like your coffee? Um, with lots of caramel. Lots of caramel, that's a great answer. I haven't gotten that one yet. In two words, uh -huh. what are you obsessed with? Branding. Um, I would say, and then music. So branding and music. Yes. Expand on that a little bit. Building a brand, I should say. Okay. Building a brand, coming up with a new concept, mm -hmm. and then executing that and seeing that evolve into something. And then music, as far as anything, basically. Live music, making music, writing music, producing music, um, finding new talent as far as music. Anything in that realm, Hey, Corbin. Take out. Hey, what are you most obsessed with in two words? Tell us. Mobile gaming. Mobile gaming. Expand on that. So I just released a free-to-play mobile game, so not the gamer, but making them and distributing a fun experience that's clean for the family. Awesome, dude. Awesome. Get in there. Get in there. Alright, guys. Except for my philosophy. We're going to get all some calls. Hey, guys. Kyle hey. with him here with uh, Coffee with Kyle's. The other Kyle's on the other side of the hey camera. Hey, Kyle. Hello. Oh, okay. well, everybody, introduce yourself. We'll start with this man. I am Chuck Stricker. I'm Mac Gagnon. Joe and Goma. All right, guys. How do you like your coffee? Black. How do you like your coffee? Black with a little sweetener. How do you like your coffee? I don't drink coffee. What do you drink instead? Tea. Good man. <laughs> Hot tea or cold tea? Yeah, you're just like, Good. Um, in two words, what are you obsessed with? My children. Great answer. Two words, what are you obsessed with? My faith. Two words, what are you obsessed with? My faith. And coffee. Wait, wait, wait. You, you drink tea? What's your shoe size? Oh, man. Probably yeah, I said that one too. Don't do What's your shoe size? What's your size? Oh, 11. Oh, wow. Dude. <laughs> 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 All right, guys. Well, oh, yeah, that was a tea bag. <laughs> Wait, that's not appropriate. That's not appropriate. <laughs> <laughs> Bombs away, guys. Bombs away. All right, guys. Thank you for joining us on uh, this edition of Coffee with Kyle's. No comments on what we just saw? What do you want? On what we just watched. On what we just watched. And uh, engaging, you want to engage the audience in some of these questions? Of course I want to engage the audience. Like, don't, we want, don't we want them to post on our LinkedIn we, post? To we say, do. hey, I have this to add to this conversation? We do. And the, I, guys, I am so tired. Uh, guys, I'm so bad at this yeah, right now. All right. So, um, but guys, you know what? I have, we have two questions for you. First question is, how do you like your coffee? Second question is, what are you most obsessed with in two words? Go. go. And on that note, have some coffee.